In this video, you will learn how to delete friends from Facebook. I recently removed over 700 of my Facebook friends from my Facebook profile, going down from something like 3,200 friends to yeah less than 2,300. And I will probably remove a couple of more friends and some of this will happen inside this video. So as you can see, like I've made a public post about this and after this, my engagement really spiked on my yeah on my Facebook newsfeed with uh, more than 100 people who just left a comment saying hi to me and uh, because they yeah I appreciate that they're still friends with me here on Facebook. So in this video we will go over different reasons why you want to remove inactive friends from Facebook despite the engagement part, what to keep in mind when you start deleting friends and especially what to keep in mind if you're removing so many people at once. And then I will show you four different ways that you can actually use to remove inactive friends from Facebook to delete them basically forever and then how to get started as fast as possible. So let's jump right into the video. So the first thing when you want to remove Facebook friends is actually thinking about quality versus quantity. I'm a friend of Carl Newport and his philosophy of digital minimalism. So it's really about quality, thinking about quality versus quantity. And I invite you to really use your Facebook account with intention. Like I'm the founder of findfocus.net, Martin Bodeca is my name. And there's a lot of really good reasons to completely remove your Facebook account and to delete it completely. For example, when I was still running my, selling my website blocker software, I've made a complete post on how to delete your complete Facebook account. But after I've switched my business models now, yeah, basically getting customers and teaching people how to get qualified customers from Facebook, I really got back to using Facebook with much more intention. And this is something that I would invite you to do as well. Think about how you can get the most out of Facebook by having much more meaningful conversations with people that you actually care about. So you spend your time talking to the right people here. And obviously there's some really good benefits if you're using this for business, but even if you just want to share and get your your content seen by your friends and your family. So you get much more visibility, which means every post that you make will get more likes and more comments, which is a really great benefit in its own. So there are a couple of things that we really have to keep in mind here. So first of all, we really need to set intentions for how we want to use Facebook. As I said before, like I'm mainly using this right now for my business. So I set different criteria and you want to set your own criteria, obviously. For example, I'm mainly uh, trying to talk to people who are interested in my Facebook CRM software and who are who really want to learn about how to use Facebook to get free traffic. And for this, I'm giving away a free software. There's a link somewhere below this video. And as I said before, you can also use this for friends and family. So when we start deleting Facebook friends, we really want to keep in mind the goal of the platform itself and especially if we want to use it with intention. So Facebook in my eyes is built as a social platform but the way it's designed it's actually to keep you more passive to just consume their content, the content there so Facebook can serve you more um, paid ads so they will make your money. So they're really trying to build the algorithm to show you posts that keep you engaged, that keep you on the platform so they can just serve you more ads. If you're using Facebook with more intention, you simply want to remove all the people that you generally do not talk to. When I, for example, I, I was a student, I had lots of friends from university, from going on vacations, from people that I've met on parties, having a beer, like, yeah, let's become friends on Facebook. And then I never talk to them again. And if you're anything like me, you might have uh, as well, like a couple of friends that you added once and never talk to because you do not really care about these people. Uh, so my suggestion, suggestion is to remove all these people from your Facebook account. So basically all the people that you do not talk to. But fortunately, there are some really easy ways to identify these people and to get rid of them. So now I will show you four different ways 
to unfriend people from Facebook. And we will go over like how to delete them one by one. I will do a quick demo how to do that, how to delete them in bulk with a uh, Chrome extension that I really like. And then I will go into how to really delete and remove inactive friends systematically with the free software that you can get from me by clicking the link below this video. And then I will show you a really cool way that I've just started recently that we added to our Facebook CRM software when they show that they are not engaging with your posts anymore. So you can get really strategic about how you use Facebook. So let's dump, jump into the different demonstrations about how you can remove your Facebook friends from your profile. So the easiest way to remove someone from Facebook is simply um, log into Facebook, then go to the friends tab and then have a look at the friends that you want to unfriend. Now, obviously this is something that I do not recommend, but I just want to show you for the purpose of this video. For example, here you can have a look at someone here like Michael Francis, and then you can have a look at yeah what kind of messages you had with him. So I will just open this in Messenger so you can see how this looks like. And then you see, hey, he's connected with me because of something from GrooveFunnels, a software that I promote as an affiliate. We had a short conversation and then I reached out, like he wished me happy birthday. I wished him happy birthday. But besides that, nothing really happened there. If, we, if you want to remove someone like Michael, simply you can go to this three dots here and then unfriend him here and then Facebook asks you if you really want to unfriend Michael and then are you sure you want to remove Michael as your friend and then you click confirm. So this is the easiest way to remove inactive friends from Facebook just going through this and then having a look at all the people that you're friends with and removing them one by one. But fortunately there are much faster ways to remove people from your Facebook's friends list. So one of the ways you can bulk delete Facebook friends and remove them is an extension by LogMay and it's called the LOC tool, like formerly multiple tools for Facebook. And with this extension, you can scan all your interactions that you had with people. And then once you scan this, you basically get a list of all the people that you're friends with on Facebook when you install this from the Chrome store. I upgraded this for full access to all the premium tools. It costs like a $20 one time price. And for this, there's two different ways you can remove friends with this. Now, currently the app is just fetching the data. And with the friends remover, you can really look for people who have deactivated accounts and then you can just click them and then you say bye bye. And then it asks, are you sure? And then you unfriend them. And then this will basically, like this is connected to your Facebook account. You're logged in with Facebook account and then these people will be removed. So then this does not give you that much really important information. So what I really like to do is use uh, the feature called interaction scanner. I scanned all the posts from January 2022 to today as yeah, me creating this video right now. And then what I do is really I filter for the type of messages. As I said before, I already removed 700 friends just before recording this video and which was the reason for me to record this video for you. And then you can also sort by like how many comments you got from people and then how many reactions, meaning how much uh, they liked your post or their recent post. So if I really set this to smaller than two, then you will see there's a lot of people who yeah engage with my posts, but I can also set this to zero. Then I get a different list here. And then if I really put this to 100 rows and then zero comments and then less than one message, I can remove all of these people in bulk that I've not really talked to and that yeah, really 
showed me that they are not interested in what I'm doing. So basically I can then really select all these people at once and then click bye bye and then yeah, are you sure you're about to remove 100 friends and then I just click unfriend and now the extension will unfriend all these people for me automatically which is a really great way to remove friends that you never talk to. Obviously you can go through this list and this is something that I recommend to do first. Go through this, see if you really want to stay friends with some of them for whatever reason, reach out to them by clicking on their name. But this is really a great way to remove or to bulk remove inactive friends from your friends list. Probably I would not remove more than 200 or 300 friends per day because otherwise Facebook might lock your account but this is really an um, extension that works amazing if you want to bulk remove friends on Facebook. So when it's fi finished you get a notification here the job is done and then yeah these people are not friends anymore on Facebook. So for example if we have a look here at Daniel I've sent him a message before and uh, he never replied he saw the message but he never got back to me so I removed him from Facebook. Okay so the thir third way is actually my favorite way to systematically reach out to people and uh, decide if I want to stay friends with them or not. For this I re reach out to them on their birthday and for this I'm using a free software tool called the happy birthday software and uh, this is the software that you can get for me uh, from me for free. It basically when you have this running it will automatically wish everyone on your birth on uh, Facebook automatically happy birthday and uh, it's a great reason to reconnect with friends and family and also potential leads and people that you want to work with or do business here on Facebook. So if we have a look at my Facebook profile or inside my Facebook Messenger here you will see it like I connected with Audrey in the GrooveFunnels community and then like I wished her happy birthday and then she got back to me and this is also currently my strategy here when I, I promise her a small gift which is the software that actually sends the happy birthday message messages and then I'm using my Facebook CRM. So um, basically um, what I'm doing with this extension is it will load uh, certain tags and then I basically tag them as happy birthday. So now Audrey is tagged as happy birthday, basically a potential lead to get my free software. And then when the software has loaded, I can send her a message. I basically sent her wonderful, here's a short video that explains and uh, what this does and gives her a little bit more context. And this is a way that I can systematically follow up with people. Same with Jeremiah here. Um, thanks for that. We never had really meaningful conversations. So I can basically do the same thing. Tag Jeremiah as a happy birthday. This is the way I'm currently doing this. I'm really sharing yeah, this free software, this software to, that allows you to really go through this systematically. Here for example, Darren is somebody I talk to a lot and he's also doing Facebook marketing on Facebook and I have not tagged him really so here I will just uh, tag him as an important person or here uh, Manuela same thing with her. I will just tag her as happy birthday. Or if we have a look here at Seb Sebastian, you will notice that I've sent him two messages. He never saw them and he never got back to me. So I can have a look at his profile here and then basically I can just unfriend him because there's no need that we need to stay connected here on Facebook. And this is a really systematic way to remove inactive friends, like wishing them happy birthday automatically. This is a great way to keep track of everyone that you're friends with on Facebook to start a meaningful conversation by wishing them happy birthday. And what you can also do then with my software which is really cool. I run complete campaigns here and here we have if we go to the uh, contacts tab inside the back office of my of the Facebook CRM we can manage inactive friends. We can remove them automatically or we can tag these people here for example as inactive friend 
And then we can run a re-engagement campaign if that makes sense. So we're not losing any leads that might be interested to buy, yeah, for example, my software or anything like your coaching offer or anything that you want to sell on Facebook. And uh, this is a great way to keep track of all the people that you're friends with in Facebook. So otherwise, it's really hard to yeah, have an overview of everything. And this is one of my favorite ways to really, yeah, systematically use Facebook to remove inactive friends from Facebook. I really want you to think about like how you can set intentions of how you want to use Facebook. What uh, do you want to use Facebook for? Read, uh, read books. Yeah. Uh, 10 reasons to delete your social media accounts right now or digital minimalism and then you will also yeah notice that you, there's a good chance that you not only want to remove inactive friends from Facebook but maybe even delete your whole account or you're taking the approach that I, I'm having right now which is still yeah connecting to a couple of friends and family there but also using this mainly for business this is what this channel is all about if you want to see more videos about this make sure you subscribe to this channel and uh, make sure that you watch the next video that I will recommend or go to the description below this video and get the free happy birthday software from me it's one of my favorite software tools because you can set it up in less than 10 minutes and it will start these conversations automatically so I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next video make sure to check out the recommended video I'm looking forward to seeing you there